Hello, welcome to Jade Kind Video Gaming. My name is Adam here with the 11th episode of Portal Stories Mel. We just got here, they're over there testing some cubes. And I'm guessing this door is just gonna open. Yep, open when I walk up to it. His hands are plastic, yours are fleshy and easily corroded. Are you, are you trying to say he's better than me? <clears throat> it's a potato. Hmm. Obviously this is the first place I walk into, right? Hate that. Reminds me of the days working in a computer shop repairing people's computers. What is this? It's like a defect in the glass or shouldn't have fiberglass insulation in your water, that's bad. Hmm. I saw that barrier over there, it's almost certainly where I'd go. But uh, I'm, I'm just gonna look around a bit first, because, you know, why not? This is cool. And, uh, I want to see all the, uh, science. Yeah, gotta love science, man. That, that, that can't be good. Sounds like the elevator's like groaning. Alright, let's go. Oh, there you are. I thought maybe somehow you managed to get lost. Anyway, we're almost at Aegis's part of the facility. Find your head here. Uh, those metal plates will hurt if they hit you. Can you believe it takes six of those plates to make one cube? Ridiculous! I'm now looking at the cube. Right, the plates. So basically, they're saying this is basically one side of the. Yeah. Okay. You see, part of me now wants to jump up and hit my head against one, just because he told me not to. Okay, this down there. Can't go that way. I am allowed to jump off here and try and dodge them, which I'm almost wondering if that's what I'm going to have to do, but before I do that, let's see if maybe there's just something down here. Where your respirator. Basically, the idea of coming down here is it lets me see that this is my goal. Alright. So, I guess... Ah! Stupid 
is in my way. And this just gets me to the other side of those barriers. All right. So I go this way. Hmm. So I'm just checking. There's lights that way. Seeing if it's trying to tell me something of uh, where to put a portal. Okay. Obviously, we go through the. I mean, has there even been a place where we could put a? I guess. I get it. We could have picked up a cube, and it doesn't want us to take one with us. Aegis's lair. What an impressive sight. Like, is this like a new, like, chapter, or is this like our boss battle? The power's been cut off here, but I think I can help. Just... Give me a Is moment. Scary? Yes, that worked. Let's get going. This reminds me of the day I ended up falling down into those junkyard oh, yeah. offices. Dark room, no lights. Hit the end of a management rail and down I went. Luckily, I found you still alive in that vault, or I'd have been stuck there forever. <laughs> so, thanks for that. Yeah. Careful, careful. Trying to be careful. There's a hole in the floor ahead. Thanks for warning me. Alright. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, there's a door. Just a bit further and we can get to the mainframe rooms. Yeah. Just tr trying. Just can't see anything. There should be a lever near that door to open it up. You ready, Mel? No. Well, I guess there's light at least, so yeah. Okay. Yeah, no. <laughs> Shutting off the lights turns off all of my I want to explore. <laughs> Interesting. Ah. Aperture, employee, guardian, and intrusion security. <clears throat> Down. Gulp. Hmm. <clears throat> Frozen. I'm, I'm not sure which. Uh, look, Mel, uh, I just wanted to say something. I I couldn't have done any of this without your help. I know. If it wasn't for you, I'd still be stuck down there in the junkyard offices. Probably my battery backup would have run out in a few days. So, thanks. Yeah, do what I So, uh, let's get this done. Whatever happens, I believe in you. Really. Organic threat and mechanical threat number one detected in central hub. Countermeasures activating. Alright, so, in order to get to the Aegis core, we need to turn on the power, unlock the doors, and replace the turrets. Once that's done, we should have a clear shot at Aegis. Let's get going. Okay. Well, those are turrets that are not yet replaced, so I cannot go that way. I cannot go that way. I cannot go that way. Oh, good. This answers the question. I go this way. Um. Oh. Yeah. 
Yeah, you're shutting down. <laughs> I shut you down. Hmm. This feels incomplete. Like maybe an old version of the... Although I guess technically with how long ago the lab shut down, maybe it's accurate to, like, try to... <laughs> every vent in here is filled with those turrets. We pulled up every last one of them a long time ago. See if there's a different way. <clears throat> generator room. Uh, one of the things was uh, something with the power, so. Okay, Mel, I'm reading that the generators are offline. Only way that the security systems can come online is to turn on those generators. But, according to my research, the manual startup is over in the control room for generator 2. And it's locked. The control room for generator 1 has a manual security override, though. Give it a try. What's the worst that could happen? Well, I did notice the destruction of office supplies will result in immediate termination, so you do need to be a little careful. So when you said, what's the worst that can happen, something bad is the answer? Hey, I was wrong. I was wrong. That was a bad idea. The security systems kicked in. You can't open the doors from the inside anymore. Hurry, find a way to turn that other generator on and get out of here. Okay, they don't just randomly shoot the glass. I don't know what to do. Quit shooting at me, I'm trying to think. Because I can't put on here. I can't go this way, so I have to do this. There's got to be basically a portable surface, portal allowable surface, or something. Okay, they do not appear to be breaking this glass. Okay. systems are now online. Oh, wait. I didn't think this through, did I? Nope. Okay. Uh, is there something for me to hide behind up there? I need them basically to break the glass. There we go. And then forget about me. Okay. 
Okay, so there's that. Okay, so now I have that blue portal there. I just need to get back to that. Okay. I am winning. I am winning. Okay. Okay, hiding again. Hi, blue portal, I need you. Going, 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 going. Behind the, uh, the, uh, these, I mean, I, I, they can't shoot. Uh, see, plain glass, glass with, um, wire through it. They cannot shoot through wire. Um. Ah, and all right, now that we have the power turned back on, we need to go to the security room overlooking the bridge to the Aegis Court. Now that the security doors have unlocked, we should be able to get there. Okay. Alright! That was a little stressful, actually. Oh, that was cool. Not that way. Oh. I don't like walking on these. to that one. Uh, okay. Oh, now hear me. Okay. I can breathe again. The the roundness of them makes them feel unsafe to me. Could also be partially the unsafeness of them that makes them feel unsafe to me. I that torch there, so this was the way I was at it. Maybe I go back and it's one of those elevators or something now. I wonder if he's, you know, keeping track of what we're doing. Oh, great. I don't think that was there before. I feel like the place is more scary over so there. This was, um, closed when we were here last. Alright, so, um, uh, I think that might not be as easy as I once thought. Uh, Aegis has done uh, quite a bit of redecorating on these catwalks. Good thing you got a portal gun. <laughs> I missed one. All right. Avoid those turrets and get to the security room. 
field that way. What on earth is that? Hmm. Anyways, um, too far to jump. Wait a minute, this lets me get in here. What does this do? Get back 
to the elevator room. Time to turn the tables on Angus. That's gonna be our return, right? And, uh, just here. So that's what that one was for. Got it. So I'm thinking all this right. means all that's left is those turrets. Remember how we the closed up the old turrets? This is where they might get useful. Head to the manufacturing line. Alright, so we turned okay, on the power, which allowed him to the quit. plan. We've got to take the turret production line down. So, there's about three ways I know to do this. The first should be easy and works most of the time. So, go into the scanner area and take the turret out. Without the model, the turrets can't be built. So we turned on the power, which allowed him to put up his... Death field. Hey now, turrets. Uh, but then we turned off security, which got rid of death field. Now we just are back, basically, which means we're back to where we are, except we have power, which is what we needed to do, I guess, this. And now we go to replace the turrets. But, uh, we're pretty much at the end of time, and I think I'm going to save that for next time. Uh, so thank you for, for watching, and join me next time as we go to the turret factory access.